I'm Jamie Zebra 23. Welcome to my channel. Um, if you'd like a personal reading, you can check out the website, jamiezebra23.com. My readings are 20 minutes, 40 minutes, and 60 minutes. I typically do your readings within 24 to 48 hours. I also have a new feature, same day readings. It's a little pricier, but you do get your readings the same day. I also have an $8 one question, one answer via email only. I typically answer you within about 20 minutes. So um, please be sure to write your email addresses correctly so that I can email you back. Also on the website, um, I have incense, sage, Florida water, Florida water soap, um, crystals, crystals, <laughs> stones, pendants, um, pendants. I have uh, pendulums for divination and prophecy. I've got full-size candles. I've also got a 10-minute tarot card reading for $25. It's not the reading special. It's something different. This is something that will be on the website every day from now on. I'm jamiezebra23.com. Please like, share, subscribe, comment. Ta-ta for now. Hi, everyone. It's jamiezebra23. I am doing your tarot card of the day for October 22nd, 2019. Um, this is for all signs. This is not for any one specific zodiac sign, so this may or may not resonate. All right, so you guys have been so, so busy. That's why I wasn't able to do yesterday's. Um, yeah, I you wouldn't believe me if I told you, but it's all positive. What's going on, I'm busy in a positive way. It's positive, nothing negative. So, yeah. Um, so I just have to plan a little bit better. Um, you know, sometimes crying babies are out of, con you know, out of my control. You can't really put a baby on a schedule. So now that I'm just getting the toddler on a schedule, you know, and then the big, you know, my 17-year-old's on, you know, he's he's chill. Um, yeah, but anyway, so I'm trying to do what I can. I'm trying to get your, your videos out here. Um, this is my first love is doing these YouTube videos, as you guys know. This is what I love to do, and I want to be able to get back to what I love doing. So anyway, so the tarot card of the day. All right, so guys, so this is what we got going on. Um, so for some of you, somebody's consulting with their mother or their father or their sister to tell they're consulting with them. So they already know what they want, but they're consulting with them. So it's kind of like, I know you hate Bob, but I miss Bob and I'm thinking about calling Bob to see if we can get back together. And they're like, oh, but remember what Bob did to you? I don't think this is such a good idea. So this could be Bob or Bobby Joe. So this could be a man or a woman they're consulting about, but somebody's consulting somebody that they, that they feel um, may or may not be on board. So it's, it's for some people, it's kind of like a warning, heads up. You know, I'm calling Bob or Bobby Joe. For some of them, they're like, hey, I need your approval to call Bob or Bobby Joe. So for some of you, um, you're going to be getting a call from somebody that's deciding now they want to work on things. So for some of you, you're going to be interested in that. For some of you, you won't be interested in that. I feel like for some people... Their mothers or fathers or whoever they are, they're not really um, too psyched about it. So they may not, when you come back in or when you're accepted back into the family or into the mix, they may not be, you know, they might be giving you fake smiles and fake hugs. And, you know, when you come over to eat, they might, <laughs> we love you and we missed you. How you been? But really, they don't mean that. They're like, oh, no, when is this person going to get out of here? Okay, so now off to something else. For some of you, you're meeting a brand new water sign, a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio. But because of the mermaids here, it's most likely a Pisces. Um, there could be a Pisces and a Scorpio connection. Um, but uh, the problem between the Pisces and the Scorpio. So let's say you're a Capricorn and you're dealing with a Scorpio. Or you're, you know, a Libra dealing with a Pisces. Or any sign connected to a, either a Pisces or a Scorpio, this could be for you as well. It doesn't necessarily have to be a Pisces and a Scorpio together, although it could be. So I feel like somebody is hiding something. Also, somebody keeps changing. Do you see this? It's like they keep changing. It's like there's mood swings. Okay, you know, the moon cycles. It's like as the moon cycle changes, but maybe daily, it seems like they have a moon cycle changing. So like their, their energy shifts from day to day. Like, you know, I'm talking to Monday Bob. I'm talking to Tuesday Bob. But each Bob is very, very different. So it's like some days I think they're into me. Some days I think they're not. So this doesn't, this could be any zodiac sign behaving this way. But I feel like for some of you, if you're an empath, it's kind of like 
so-and-so doesn't need to tell you anything. You can just feel that they're different. They're being weird. There's something off. It's true. For some of you, it just might be, you know, they have, you know, some mental health stuff going on. For some, some people, they just don't, you know, they're just doing them and they don't really care about your feelings and that's why. And then for others of you, the reason why is because there is a third party situation going on. I also feel like maybe they have somebody in their ear telling them, you know, not to call you, not to deal with you. They're not accepting you. So that could be another reason why the person's energy is kind of off. But I feel like for the most part, um, there may be, I mean, the biggest positive here is that maybe if you guys are hoping to hear from somebody from the past, you're hoping to work it out. It, you know, when I say past, they could have broken up with you yesterday. So if you're hoping to hear from them, you'll probably hear from them and you guys can be back on. But there's definitely somebody thinking about you and consulting with other people. Especially if you've been with them before. So it's sort of like, hey, do you, rem do you remember Bobby Joe from 20 years ago, from 50 years ago, from a week ago, from six months ago, a year ago? Do you remember them? Well, they got into contact with me or I contacted them and we're going to start seeing each other. So if you want to do this, do this. If you don't want to do this, hang up the phone on them and tell them hell no. Whatever. Whatever you got to do. It's your choice. It's your life. You guys do what you want. All right. So um, that was your tarot card of the day. If you'd like a personal reading, you can check out the website, jamiezebra23.com. My readings are 20 minutes, 40 minutes, and 60 minutes. I typically do your readings within 24 to 48 hours. I also have a new feature, same day readings. It's a little pricier, but you do get your readings the same day. I also have an $8 one question, one answer via email only. I typically answer you within about 20 minutes. So please be sure to write your email addresses correctly so that I can email you back fairly quickly. Also on the website, jamiezebra23.com, um, I've got full-size candles, do-it-yourself love kits, protection kits, prosperity kits, crystal stones, pendants, Florida water, Florida water soap, incense, sage, protection bracelets, pendulums for divination and prophecy. I also have a 10-minute tarot card reading for $25. It's not the reading special. This is something different. This is something that will be on the website every day from now on. I'm jamiezebra23.com. Ta-ta for now.